Good morning, everybody. It's your girl, Stephanie Robles here. And I have not done one of these motivational, earth-shaking videos in a while. Um, My event for Monday was amazing. I was so scared to sit here and do something so out of my comfort zone um, that I had to talk and I get so nervous and I didn't know what to do. And then I was flubbing over my words. And then once it all came from a place and I remembered that when you're a value to other people and you get in touch with what is deep in your heart and your soul, it all just flows out. And that has been a hard lesson to learn. You have so many creative thoughts locked up in your head or you feel like you're blocked. Your creative juices are just blocked and you don't know how to unblock it. Sometimes you have to get real with yourself. Like what is blocking you? What is that emotional block for you? Is it something that you're going through in life? Or is it... Um, you're just so stressed or you're worried or you're concerned about whatever you're going through sometimes. Sometimes you have a really, really good idea, but you don't implement it because you don't know how to. And that's when you gotta, you, you definitely have to research and learn. When you're going through those hard times, what can I do? How to make myself better? How can I educate myself? A lot of times, you'll be surprised of the resources that you have at your disposal that don't cost you very much. If you want to be um, a better salesperson, some people have the gift of talk and they can talk really, really well. Go find somebody that is on YouTube. They have downloadables for you. Um, get your education, learn how to properly uh, communicate with people because communication is key. If you want something, look for it. If you have an idea, think about what you can do that you wouldn't normally do. Sometimes taking those chances out in life will turn out to be the most amazing thing you ever you've ever done i'm so excited and happy i never ever 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 thought that i would ever be in this position right now and i'm working and you you let the what if stop you in your life you 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 don't know if you can handle it all you and again and it's one of those fear things it's one of those unknown things that you definitely fear and once you do it it's going to take you to amazing heights as long as you sit there and you do the work and you dig deep what is it how can i help somebody else and that's what it boils down to i honestly believe in the laws of attraction when you help somebody out of the kindness of your heart or you provide um help or service to somebody maybe it is the universal karma of things things in your life will start to change when you eliminate the people that are bringing negative vibes into your area if you're going through a rough patch in your life the five people that you surround yourself around the most is the attitude is just going to get contagious and if you want better for yourself, you want to do better, you want to be better, you want to feel better, surround yourself with positive people. There's a season and a reason for everything and everyone in your life. And sometimes we outgrow people. We're human. We outgrow them and we evolve and we get better and we change. And I'm telling you, once you surround yourself with such positive, motivational, uplifting people, you're, it's almost like a bank. Like your happiness gets too expensive to deal with anybody else's stuff. You don't have time for it. You don't have time to subscribe to that channel, that drama or their catalog. You just run away, you go away and you be you. 
Nothing can stop you in this life unless you allow that to happen. Maybe you're having a hard time in your life. Maybe you've lost someone. Maybe you're going through, you've lost your rhythm. You've, you've lost something inside of you. I'm telling you, go outside, take a walk, take time for yourself to reconnect with yourself. Do whatever you need to do to make yourself happy. Whatever it is, maybe listening to music, maybe writing, uh, journaling it, drawing. A lot of people do that. Sometimes I love to meditate. Ever since um, I started meditating in the morning, I've been reading the Miracle Morning and words of affirmation and all of that is amazing. Hey, Casey girl. It's also that is true. It is true. And if they're withdrawn from your friendship bank, like the last post you did yesterday, you don't like liars. Toss them, girl. You don't need that negativity, especially when you're dealing with your everyday life and you're going through craziness. As your husband's deploy and things like that, I've been there and I get that. And you don't have time for it. You have bigger and better fish to fry. You got your kids. They love you. You've got other people that are in your corner watching you. I care about you, girl. So keep shining like you always have. Because you're amazing and can't nobody else be you. You know what you go through. And can't nobody stop you. And you have fun. And keep sending those videos, Casey. Because I, I see those pictures of you and your kids in the mornings. They make me smile. And make me happy. And make me feel good. So you keep snapping those pictures of those babies. Because they're amazing. And they're beautiful. And they love their mom. And enjoy those hugs in the morning. And those are the things that matter. Families matter. Families matter. If you have kids, just take that whole day to do nothing but love on them. There is nothing that will make you feel better than hugging on your kids and them teaching you something. Because let me tell you, these kids, they're like little multi personalities. Like, one minute they're happy, one minute they're sad, one minute they're crazy. It brings you to a moment where they start teaching you some things about yourself that you never even thought were possible. You're going to learn a whole new way of living your life because your bank is too full. You ain't got time for drama and you don't have time for any pettiness or hating. Haters are always going to hate, but they can never be you. Oh, somebody's going to steal your idea. Don't worry about them. Worry about you. When your blinders are on and you're focused on what you need to do and what you want to do and the success that you want to get in your life, nothing will get in that way. Nothing will stop you from doing whatever you want to do. It won't. And if it does, dust yourself off and get back up and keep going. Never let them see you sweat. Never let them see you cry and keep it moving. Because at the end of the day, the only person you have to be better than is yourself. Are you better than you were yesterday? Yes. Okay, then keep moving. And every day improve yourself. Every day get better. Learn something wiser. Be stronger. Because you do have that capacity to do that. And whenever fear, you start getting scared or lonely or you start doubting yourself, remember everything that you went through. Everything that you went through to bring you from back then to where you are now, you defeated it, you conquered it, and you ruled it. This is just one stumble block in the journey in the road. Just like my quote this morning. A journey of a thousand steps starts with that first step. Just take that first step and keep digging deep. Keep digging, keep pushing, keep working. And sometimes throw a little uh, cha-cha or a little Roomba in there. And make it a part of the dance if you stumble. Because nothing can stop you. It's a beautiful fall day, guys. Look, I'm in uh, Publix. Look at the leaves changing. I got to go get the girls their milk and get some groceries. I like Publix. They're uh, 
produce is amazing. Their grapes are awesome. And their apples too. So I hope you guys have an amazing rest of the day. I gotta go uh, do my mommy duties because that's what I do. And we're problem solvers. Remember that. We solve problems. We do it every day of our lives. We're problem solvers. But when you're stressed, you can't see the way out. So calm yourself. Do whatever you need to do to center yourself. Calm yourself. And I promise you that a solution will present itself to you. And you're going to rock it. Tough times don't last. Tough people do. And trust me. <clears throat> excuse me. You're tough. You're one tough cookie. So I hope you guys have a great rest of that day. And I'm going to see you guys later. Bye, everybody.